Hey guys, welcome to my channel. This is my very first video. So let me introduce myself first. My name is Kushal and I am recently graduated from Job Agri Government Engineering College. This year I got AIR 49 in Gate CSE and I admitted in IIT Madras in MTEC CSE. Nowadays I am getting various queries regarding my Gate preparation in LinkedIn and WhatsApp. So I decided to make a YouTube video and share my journey with you all. So today's video will be my great journey. Watch till the end and support me throughout my YouTube journey. So let's start the video. How GET came to my mind? I want to start from my initial days when I was preparing for JE. I started my JE preparation in my class 11. 11 gone well. But in class 12, COVID-19 came. So I had to come back in my village. And my all schedule got messed up. Also, offline to online shifting was a bit hard for me. After giving JE main, I got All India rank 60,000. And in JE advance, I got 27,000 rank. So you know, by this rank, you could not get any NIT or IIT. So, I wrote West Bengal Joint Entrance Examination and by this exam, I got to Chalpaiguri Government Engineering College from where I graduated result. So, I was very much disappointed with my JE main and JE advanced rank. So, I decided to take a drop with my BTEC first year curriculum. After a few months, I was introduced to CP by our seniors and I started to do this and I enjoyed it. So, Throughout the first year, I did only CP and learned DSA. But in second year, my seniors who were doing CP did not get placed because of registration. And then I started to learn basic web development. I started with HTML, CSS and JavaScript besides my DSA and problem solving. So in summer vacation in my third year, I found my JE books and I thought if I had prepared better, then I would have been in any NIT or IIT today. My father always supported me and always told me that you should do pursue masters from any prestigious institute. And after that, I started my gate preparation for rectifying my mistakes, which I did in my JE preparation. So when I decided to give in gate, I had to find out my mistakes, whatever I did in my JE times. So I found out all the mistakes and noted down in a notebook. And the mistakes was like I had not made any proper note. And second mistake was I had no proper planning about my strategy and about my uh, completing my syllabus, uh, giving mock test. I had no planning about that. And uh, third number is uh, there is lack of consistency. So I had to rectify all three in my K2024 journey. So in K2024, I had to overcome all these mistakes. So I had made a proper planning. At first I note down all the subjects that I have and go through the syllabus of KCSE and started lectures from my strong subjects like engineering mathematics and discrete mathematics. Eventually, I completed all the subjects within November. I took notes of each subjects. I did PIQ of 10 to 15 years. And also I did topic wise mock test. And November onwards, I started to give mock test. And in mock test, in my first mock test, I got 29 marks only. And after that, I practiced much and eventually my score increased. And in my last mock test, during February, I got 64 marks. And in GATE 2024, I got 68 marks and 280 rank. After GATE 2024, I was a bit confident because I was expecting under 1000 rank, but I got under 500. And by this rank, I can get IIT Guwahati or IIT Kharagpur easily. So, I was focused on placement preparation that time. 
I uh, started to making some projects and also focused on DSA and aptitude part for my placements. And after month of August, I started get preparation again. I followed the same strategy of K2024. At first, I found out all the mistakes I have done in K2024. So my first mistake was I have not completed all the subjects in detail, like in computer networks, operating system, and in compiler design. There were some topics which I uh, have not completed in that much detail. So I completed that first and after that I found that I have not made any proper note about like short notes you know. So I have not made any short notes of any subjects. But the short notes are very uh, crucial for revising a subjects first. So I had to make short notes of all subjects. So I started to make short notes and it also helped me for revising all the subjects during making the notes. So I had made all the subjects short notes and also I had a very big mistake that I had not analyzed the mock test properly. So I started to keep mock test in the time of November and I analyzed each and every mock test uh, properly like uh, how many marks I have getting, which topic I am like uh, did not getting marks and what type of mistakes I am doing I am doing like uh, it's a silly mistakes or it's a conceptual mistakes so I have noted down all the things in my diary you can see my samples of diary where I analyzed my mock test after recovering all my mistakes, what I have done in my previous gate attempt, when I gave my last mock test, I got 75 plus marks and my confidence boosted. And in the original exam in gate 2025, I got 72 raw marks in SIP 2 and that got normalized to 84.61 and I got 49 rank. In between gate preparation, in the month of December, I appeared for my campus placement drive and I got an internship plus full-time offer at Prism Force. If you guys want to know my placement preparation and interview experience at Prism Force, please comment it down. I will surely make a video about that. So this was about my gate preparation. It had ups and downs, doubts and motivation. But at the end, it was worth it. I will be sharing many strategies about gate preparation and also the resources I have used in this channel. And also, I will share some tips for computer science students for getting placements and gate. So if you find my video helpful, please like the video and subscribe the channel and comment down your doubts below. Thank you for watching. Take care and all the best for your journey ahead.